Hey guys, so I wanted to just take a minute to talk to you about how Beachbody coaches are not salespeople. So although we're in sales and we have to sell things, don't get me wrong, um, we are more of what we call share people. So if you've ever like gone out and recommended something to someone, many of you just doing these programs probably have already talked about it to someone, right? That you're feeling better, losing weight, you know, maybe you're seeing your abs or your calf or your bicep for the first time, whatever it might be, I can guarantee that most of you in this group have already talked about Beachbody to somebody. So that's basically what we do. We stay on our own fitness and health journey and we invite other people to do it with us, to join us and do it too. So how do you not be annoying? Well, you don't be a salesperson. That's basically how you don't be annoying about it. Um, you know, so I, I can guarantee that you've seen people that maybe do annoy you because they're like, excuse me here, they're like, hey, this is my Shakeology. I showed it to you yesterday and the day before, the day before then, I'm gonna show it to you again tomorrow. And here it is again. Do you wanna buy it from me? Um, but that's not, the idea of the coach, the idea of the coach, and don't get me wrong, the, the financial piece comes from someone purchasing a program from you. But they can purchase it, you know, from anybody. They can purchase it on Beachbody.com and get assigned a random coach. The idea is that they're going to do it with you with you supporting them, with you encouraging them, with you saying, take my hand, let's do this together. I'll keep you accountable, you keep me accountable, we'll share our, our, our journey together, we'll share some recipes, we'll share every step along the way and get each other through it and reaching our goals. So that's the beauty of this particular um, company is that you are sharing a journey with them. So they can buy it from anyone, but they're much more likely to do it and get the results if they're doing it with a coach and a coach that cares about them and a coach that they feel like they can um, rely on. And so that's where you come in. So that is the beauty of this. I literally, I have no sales background. I've um, never sold anything and I can't think of anything else I could sell. And that is what really held me back at first with number one with even doing this and then number two, once I was in it, um, it definitely held me back my first six months of feeling like, you know, being stuck in this little thing of like not wanting to sell. And the day that I realized that I wasn't selling was the day that everything turned around. So, you know, if you don't have that in mind, if you don't have it in mind that you want someone's money, but you want to help them, you want to share in this journey with them, you want to show them this awesome thing that you found that changed your life and that you know can make theirs better too. And that's what it's all about. So how do you not be annoying? That's how. You don't have in mind that you're making a sale. You have in mind that you are just sharing what you're doing. You're putting it out there. You're talking about it. Not all day every day, but once a day, you're talking about it. You're sharing some piece of your journey. And people know that you are there if they wanna do it too. Um, so that's about it. And, you know, as far as the details go with how this and how would I that and, you know, you can, there's so many options. So don't let that hold you back. Your coach can help you with, with all of that, with how you, there's, there's different ways to launch. There's different ways to promote. Um, and there's all different ways of inviting and everyone has something that works best for them. So just keep an open mind with that and don't get hung up on, you know, someone's going to think you're annoying or you're not into sales because it's actually a good thing. I think that salespeople could have a problem with this because salespeople want to make the sale. Bam, you gave me the money. I gave you the goods. Exchange is done. And this actually starts at the exchange. This relationship starts at the exchange. Once the once the money and goods are exchanged, that's when your job starts with the person and your journey with them begins. So that's my spiel. It's, you know, so much more than um, 
making a sale or the payback that you get from helping someone, even just one person, with these products and with this journey, um, it's just, you know, you can't put a price on it. So if you're thinking about it and that's what's holding you back, I'd say trust me and go for it and, you know, we'll help you. We'll help you with that whole piece. So, all right. Thanks, guys. That's it.